Um, did you ever play around with much like uh, bringing in like beneficial bugs, like ladybugs, or? I never, I never did, just because I, I just noticed that they, if you do that, they just fly off. They fly away. They, yeah. they don't stick around. <laughs> yeah, I think it makes sense in a greenhouse where you can contain them. Right. But in the field, I think that's where your Ellie, your flowers will come in. They're going to draw in. Yeah. Or if you have some areas that are unused on your farm that you're not going to, you know right next to the tunnel i don't know somewhere where you're not going to make money throw some perennial you know or annual flowers there yeah and just uh, I, you know what else helped me uh trees having a lot of trees around i noticed there's uh tons of birds they would come and eat worms off of my plants yeah they never messed up my beds or ate my seed or anything those, those helped me a lot yeah just the more nature that are is around will help the balance what about bees did you ever? Um, we mean like honey? Yeah. Like, did you ever have hives? Or yeah, I did that at my at my parents' house. I had a hive because I couldn't do it at my um, other landlord's house. But um, it was yeah, it was fun. I just I only had them for like a year because I had there's these Argentinian ants that are like gnarly in San Diego, and they just like they wipe out all the other native colonies of ants, and wow. they 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 like they uh, robbed my hive. I didn't go. I'd go there like once or every week or two to go check on them. And the I went to check and then like they all left because the ants raided their hives. Yeah, so we have that issue with wasps here. They, yeah. yeah. And bees, bees are tricky. Like, like, yeah, well, yeah, I mean. And it's a bit of an investment, but I mean, it's good, but I'm wondering if it's worth it. I don't know. Maybe next year. Yeah, I would say wait. Yeah. Wait, wait on that. But it is another cool little avenue I, I feel like you need quite a few hives to make it worth you know it. a decent yeah, rev revenue thinking, generator. Like, just being beneficial to the bees yeah i mean it will definitely help like every single squash flower will be fertilized and you know i think for that aspect it's huge like you'll you i bet it will boost your um fruit you know fruiting crop production another well here's another um, possible idea for the bee situation is is mason bees and like native North American native bees mason and the other one is uh, uh what are they called uh, I'm blanking on the name but there's another native bee but you can set up little bee houses for them yeah. and they're fantastic yeah, pollinators as well that's another yeah. option and that's like a maintenance free like yeah maybe start there yeah it could be a good place